Hi, it's John here. Now, this is quite a complicated one, and I hope people can follow my reasoning. Reasoning in inverted commas, because my reasoning is always a bit uh, a bit odd and skewed. Now, my uh, support of UKIP um, may be ill-founded, but I still go along with it. Now, my initial thought on UKIP was that it wasn't a very good idea to be have the UK flooded with economic migrants uh, from Eastern Europe. Um, therefore, uh, it's better to um, keep keep uh, keep UK independence and then be able to um, haul up the drawbridge, as it were, uh, and stop uh, stop people coming uh, economic migrants. Now, this um, premise is based upon the idea that you can force people to do unskilled work and to do manual labour. Um, manual labour mainly. I mean, I don't think people mind doing unskilled work, like checkout work, because it's not hard work. But uh, I think generally people don't like actual work, um, uh, like, say, actually caring for people in an old people's home or cutting um, asparagus um, where you have to work very hard and bend your back all day. Um, and in a way there's uh, a conspiracy against work amongst the young people. Um, you know, academic work is seen as far higher um, status-wise than uh, manual work. Now, if I think back uh, on my uh, on my various bits of employment, and I think of people who are actually very good at hard manual work and actually sort of um, enjoyed it, you know, one might even say had a vocation towards it. There are actually quite a f quite few, quite few, not very many people were actually good at manual work. I mean, I can't say I was particularly good. Um, I wasn't very good on concentration, uh, concentration on, on repetitive work, and I wasn't very good on stamina, so my stamina would let me down as well. Um, so I, I'm good at short bursts of manual work, you know, 10 minutes, half an hour, an hour, you know, but uh, eight hours, no, not really. Um, so it, on a good day, I think uh, the proportion of people who are actually good at manual work would only be 10% of the population. And then um, I knew a man once who... Who, who was uh, who, who was good at manual work and, and could lift massive weights and um, and, and, and work very hard and, and loved even uh, running like jogging about the place and playing rugby but I met him a few years ago and he, his body was absolutely shot you know he'd worn all his joints out and he was crippled with arthritis um, so there's another thing that has to be borne in mind but so if you can't actually get people to do with the manual work and you've only got 10% of the population who are able to do the manual work, um, you've got to get them from outside, haven't you? Generally, I would say that the Africans, they are, they are not particularly, they're, they're good at manual work, but they're not, they're not exactly the, um, <laughs> they're a bit laid back. Um, and probably uh, uh, the Eastern Europeans, you know, they really have got the, uh, the work ethic. You know, because they, they want the money. It's, um, can't really say it's the Protestant work ethic, it's just a sort of survival work ethic. Work ethic. Uh, and they want the money and, and they send it home to their families, so that's quite good. Um, so my, re my initial reasoning on, on UKIP may have been completely wrong, but uh, I'm still going to vote UKIP. Right, bye for now.